every Muslim is born this before they take shahada. Is this what people say sometimes the only way out of Islam is? Is death. That's, that's the fact. But still, this is the miracle. It's still the fastest growing religion. Knowing this, people still accept it. Christians, Jews are still accepting Islam. I'm not surprised no, it's the fastest growing religion in the world when the penalty for leaving Islam is death. Renouncing the message of Islam, the sin of apostasy, is certainly a serious business. But many moderate Muslims would balk at users' views on the death sentence. Their view is that faith is a matter of personal assent, and point to one of the Quran's most celebrated texts to make their point. Surah 2, verse 256, there is no compulsion in religion. Uh, peace of Christ to all. In this video, as you see, as usual, you know, we show you how Muslims do lie. Now, watch with me carefully and discover the lie. You know, this is why our videos is important. Because you do not know. And as long as you do not know, they will fool you. Now, we saw part of this video and we saw this gentleman supposedly who he converted to Islam and he think that Islam is a fastest a growing religion by convert this is not the fact a growing religion by birth and 99% of them they are dying from hunger again you know like Darfur and Sudan and uh, Indonesia and Bangladesh so uh, actually the, the increase of number of Muslims in the Islamic world is, is, is extremely dangerous for them not for anyone else they will, they will pay the high price for it because they, they you know uh, they lay eggs they don't give kids you know they lay eggs and they cannot afford it even to take care of their kids this is why the crimes is so high this is why their, their, their country is long behind every country in the world uh, they are living in the cave time so what the benefit of having one billion you know when a country like Netherlands alone the GDP income is more than a three three times more than all the Islamic world together a country is not even 12 millions uh, or Israel you know which is not even five millions anyway this is not a topic but here we will show you <coughs> uh, how how they they lie when they are you know when the, the the interview ask him ask this guy about the death penalty you will see this guy he have silence he didn't know what to say he told him well if you leave Islam you know that you know you know the penalty it is death he said yeah and still there is people uh, accept this is this is the miracle yeah absolutely it's a miracle you know uh, I think only fool they accept that but I believe you are a hypocrite in that point because you live in the state USA and they cannot practice that on you but if you live in the Middle East and you decide to leave Islam one day you know you know the answer I'm not going to tell you in here you can leave it now you know who care and there's a lot of people who live in USA they are leaving Islam big time like the Iranian but anyway you know you are safe from Muslims and you know they can do nothing to you in here let us see where is the lie and let us talk about it well when the penalty for leaving Islam is death look at the silence renouncing the message of Islam the sin of apostasy <coughs> is certainly a serious business but many moderate Muslims would balk at users' views on the death sentence. Their view is that faith is a matter of personal assent, and point to one of the Quran's most celebrated texts to make their point. Surah 2, verse 256, there is no compulsion in religion. Okay, is it true really there is no compulsion in religion, in Islam? He mentioned to you a verse, and he gave us the verse. Is that true? or this is a lie you know always we hear Muslims pointing this verse for us and many because they don't know you know they accept it they say oh okay wow this is good this religion don't force people to uh, 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 you know convert to Islam but the Muslims will never tell you that the Quran is full of verses it's abrogated it is abrogated which mean you are not allowed to follow no more it is there. Muhammad, he made those verses of when he was weak. He was a potato. Which mean, you know, he have no power over them anyway. He said, okay, you know what? Uh, I, cannot force, I cannot force you. 
This is the whole idea. The day he was able to force, he changed his mind. You see why Muhammad is a hypocrite? Muhammad is the same as every Muslim. Muslims, they live in the West as, as Muslims, they live everywhere in three stages. The first stage when they are weak, they are soft, they are nice, you know, uh, they are potatoes like you. Whatever you say to them, okay, all right, you know, I'm a Muslim, I cannot, you know, I, you know, I am a Muslim. We've been ordered to be nice to everybody. Later, when they are like, let's say, 10% or 15% of the population, you will see the Muslims, they are going more aggressive, like what happened in France. For three months, they are burning cars, destroying the stores, you know. Wait until they are 50%, the country will be under their control, period. Because the aggressive is a lot more, you know, uh, powerful from the one is soft. The one who believe in beheading, he can control the one who don't believe in beheading easy. Terror is the key. Terror is the way. Now let us show you in here how those gentlemen in here, they love to lie when they say the Quran have a verse. It says no compulsion in, in religion. Let us go and see how we can expose this lie. This is an Islamic website. I will show you the website from the top so nobody can say to me, this is not true Islamic website. This is a Christian website maybe, right? Because we know Muslims. We know and you know Muslims. It's called thequran.com. Okay? Thequran.com. As you see in the screen, this is thequran.com, not my website, Islamic website. And now we will show you.